This is not just the statement and thought process of RJD, it is the thought process of the entire Indi Alliance. Today, at the time when we are doing Nari Shakti Ko Vandan by passing the constitutional guarantee under the leadership of Prime Minister Modi for women's reservation, at the same time 50% of the women the 50% population of this country are being humiliated and insulted by the Indi Alliance. And no leader of Indi Alliance, Congress Party, etc. has condemned the statement, which means they agree with the statement. And this is not the first time. This is the same bunch of people. This is the same Jamaat that had opposed any women's rights in the name of vote bank politics. From Shah Banu to Shaira Banu, they stood against women's rights. In the parliament, we have seen SP, RJD, how they have torn the copies of Women's Reservation Bill earlier. And the Congress party has always stood with such parties because the Congress itself is anti-women. See what is happening in Rajasthan, Hanumangarh, Seeker, Jaipur, Pratapgarh, Bhilwada, all these incidents took place, but Rahul Gandhi has not uttered a single word. In fact, Congress women are unsafe in Congress party itself. Archana Gautam, their leader has been humiliated and beaten up outside the Congress office. Kalpana Varma, their MLA has been humiliated by Congress leaders. But no statement, no action by Congress party. Today, the Congress party must tell us.